priority message to all active duty agents. Be aware that Agent Aaron Keener, call sign Vanguard, has had his agent status revoked and is now a priority target. Hello guys, it's Queenie here and today we're going to go through a, a few of my raid builds that I use within the PC side. First is up is the Drone Killer build. Uh, I tend to use this uh, in Dark Hours on the Razorback encounter. There is also a few times within Dark Hours itself I will switch to Drone Killer to help out the team. Let's go over the build. I run the crossbow. Uh, I tend to use the police M4 with flat line as an AR. Uh, the flat line talent gives you amplifies weapon damage by 15% to pulse enemies. After three kills, applies pulse enemy, enemy pulse to the next enemy hit. I don't really use the police M4 all the way through the Razorback encounter. I would use the Scorpio. Uh, my Scorpio's got. Um, shotgun damage, damage to armor and crit hit damage. The talent is septic shock. It's a really good talent by the way. Shooting a target applies stacks of venom which lasts for 10 seconds. Increasing stacks adds more severe debuffs to the target. One hit is poison. Three hits disorientate them. Six shot six hits, this is my favourite, it shocks them. Seven shots takes an additional twenty percent damage from all sources. Stacks no longer increase. Duration of status effects is based on the percentage of the pellets hit on iron shot. Uh, we also use a 4P's hardwire build. Uh, I use Four pieces myself. Use the mask. Uh, two pieces of hardwire gives us fifteen percent skill haste. Three pieces gives us fifteen percent skill damage. Thirty percent repair skills, which is pretty cool. Four pieces gives gives us the talent which is feedback loop which is what we were after Call, uh, let's go over the talent and then I'll explain whenever you use or cancel a skill your other skill cooldown is automatically reduced by 30 seconds while increasing total skill damage and repair by 10% Twenty seconds feedback loop can occur once every twenty seconds. The way that the four piece hardwire works with Razorback, every time you use the jammer pulse, you put your restore hive on the ground and it will reset the jammer pulse, which really helps when I mean the drones when they come out with Razorback. The second piece I use is the backpack. It's roll to skill damage. 
the bolster, which is also rolled skill damage, and the knee pads, which is also rolled skill damage. I use the BTSU gloves. which come with skill haste and repair skills. The talent on the gloves, transference overclock grants 15% high skill haste per skill tier. Bear in mind, when we run this build, we're running six tier. Detonating a hive refreshes your skill cooldowns and grants overcharge for 15 seconds. If at skill tier 6, this effect also applies to all allies. Allies receiving this effect are unable to benefit from it again for 60 seconds. So it, when I put my hive down and I destroy it, I'll activate of, uh, overcharge I'll give my team overcharge for 120 seconds it will refresh their skills if they're on cooldown it'll increase the damage output if you're using a drone or a turret and It's pretty, pretty awesome. I do love the overcharge. Alright. The chest piece. I currently use a wyvern chest piece with skill haste and skill damage. The talent that I use is overwatch. After staying in cover for 10 seconds increases your your allies total weapon damage and skill damage by 12% long as you remain in cover or in a cover to cover move. Um, I love using overwatch it helps the team out when we've got a low damage and there's been a few raids that I've actually hosted or been in where we've had a little bit of a damage issue and Overwatch has out massively. This drone killer build, I do like it the way it's built, though we can run a wyvern chest piece with glass cannon or we can run caesar's guard with caesar's guard you won't be able to use the btsu gloves you'll need to have a empress Gloves with skill haste and skill damage on. I have all my hard wire pieces. Roll to skill damage. I use protection from elite mods on the chest piece, the mask, and the backpack purposely to try and help out when on very very rare occasions ads get loose and start shooting me I've got that little bit of protection also on dark hours we will be using the healer build agent requesting backup The skills that I use for a drone killing is a jammer pulse, a 
I've got 20.1 seconds on cooldown. A EMP effect duration, I've got 4.8 seconds. 34 meters of radius. Charging time, 2 seconds. I also use the Restorer Hive. I've got a refill speed of 1 second. I've got 36 charges. The range is 12.8 meters. Duration is quite huge. And uh, as you can see, the health healing is really big numbers, which is a really good factor. Was there already a second crossbow? As I run to the window, doesn't look like it. So I will thank you very I much. I my hive down yep. on the ground. <laughs> and if I run, I just the jump down and wipe. I will also jam the black tusk. Mm -hmm. Nice hive down, guy. From shooting grenades. You got your donkey on? <laughs> yes. <clears throat> I know. I have habit of going down here with healer. In this case, it didn't show me your uh, second skill. That's why I was asking. It's showing me a blank on your second skill. Lately it has a habit of doing that on uh, Razorback for me for some reason. Where do you need me? You're going outside too. The hive. Oh, hey. All my team is healed. I'm really Give me the worst places. Someone on out four who can do the weak point? Uh, Hadley's on four. You can... Perfect. Uh, do the rev. Alright, is everybody ready? No, oh, hang on. Hang on. Um, soon. Gotta kick cones first. <laughs> I'm ready. Alright, circles. Anytime you're not ready, tell me. Or just tell me to shut up. Circles in three, two, one, in. Since my drone killer build has Overwatch on it, I will stay in cover the entire fight. The only time I will come out of cover is at the end of the fight. 80%. 90. I will get crossbow Thanks ready, shoot the, shoot the gate, and jam. I will do a cover to cover move, drop the hive, Left and is jam. Broken. Motors. Run. Three, we'll do two, another one, cover to cover in. move. Call eighty percent. Get ready. Crossbows out. Break the gate. Jam. Cover to cover move, hive down, jam. Motors, Ganga. Shouldn't just down on two. Circles in three, two, one, in. I'm lucky with my team. They have the ads under control. Oh, good. I use protection for me mods to help me stay safe. 80. We'll get ready with the crossbow again. We'll break the gate. Jam. Cover to cover move. And jam.
Back's broken. Oh. Put the hive down to heal people. Going for ammo. And jam. I have only been doing Martyrs. this role for three months. It was the very last month. Circle. Three. Two. Roll that I one, actually in. learned. I refused to learn it oh, until I joined oh, TSW. Chug about. Chunga. Ooh. Gunslinger. Got his ads. 80% again. Okay, Gunslinger. Crossbow's ready. I got it, Queenie. Do we get the gate? An ad actually got loose there, but that's a rare thing with my team. We do the cover cover move. And we do the final jam. Pause. On two. And I'm talking to myself and I'm muted. <laughs> <laughs> the way to do it. It's just how we like you. Just as well you just as well you didn't hear anything I was saying about you then, Max, isn't it? <clears throat> you, I don't care, say what you want. No, Max, was actually, don't die. It was actually all good things if I'm being honest. Party I was actually four. I was actually saying I was doing I was doing worse than you actually do. That's not possible. I don't know, I've gone down more times than you have, if I'm being honest, Max. <laughs> <laughs> it's all the watch something. It's all the watch level, that's all it is. Exactly. It's just not possible. 